One thing is making commercial laundry by self for more profit at less cost. Another thing is, does the soap foam, does the soap have enough cleansing power? Well, only you can answer that. My name is Justin Joe, and I've been a producer of local homemade laundry bar soap and other detergent making for years now. In fact, I own laundry bar soap factories across three locations in Nigeria. Some people do ask me, except for the fact that your liquid soap and your laundry bar soap are really cheap in the market, but they still foam and has a lot of cleansing power. How do you do it compared to the big brands in the market? I just tell them, the truth is, is to boost your soap with foam booster. So we are going to learn how this works, so stay tuned. Alright guys, welcome back. In your lesson 2, you learned how to bleach a palm oil without using fire. Now, you are supposed to use a palm oil to make your basso. But the problem here is that, with the kind of method I'll be teaching you on how to make the profitable basso, you will, you will need to be putting other forms of chemicals to increase the quantity and to increase the hardness of the soap, thereby making it to lose cleansing power and foaming power. Which means that the soap may not really foam well. And in that aspect, you will need to go and buy artificial foam booster from the same chemical store in your environment to activate it. Or you buy an artificial chemical artificial foam booster, for example, to, to activate the foaming, the foaming power of your soap and the cleansing power of your laundry basket. It will be a kind of increasing the cost of production. So I decided to teach you how to make a foam booster on your own by buying few raw materials in the chemical shop to produce it on your own so that you use it as much as you want which will also mean decreasing your cost of production so but in the part of making this foam booster this foam booster will be called Texapon N70 it is made with sodium sulfate it is a kind of powder that looks like salt sodium sulfate is a emotional chemical it looks like salt and you also use SLS rice SLS, the foaming of SLS is sodium laureate sulfate. You understand, right? So when you add SLS with sodium sulfate, it now becomes Texapon N70. And, then, and this Texapon N70 is called in a chemical formula SLES, which is sodium laureate eta sulfate. It will act as a sulfate in your soap to increase the cleansing power of your laundry parcel and to boost the foam, the foam for people to wash the clothes and enjoy it and it is going to be made with hot water a mixture of sodium sulfate with sodium laureate sulfate would form sodium laureate eta sulfate which is what we call the second N70 that is the foam booster so you are going to learn this now alright guys enough of all the explanation now let's see how we can make the foam booster so join us in the production okay to make a commercial homemade texapon for your commercial laundry basket production, step one, all you will need is to boil 1073 grams of water to at least 100 degrees Celsius. Then dissolve 161 grams of sodium sulfate and 267 grams of SLS rice in it. Now stay the mixture continuously until it completely dissolves while becoming thickening up like pack in the process. Although the 161 grams of sodium sulfate added will quickly dissolve once you've added it to the water. But the 267 grams of SLS rice you've also added will be partially dissolved as some of them will be floating on top of the hot water as well. But don't you worry because the hot water itself will do the remaining job for you. All you will have to do next is to cover it up and leave it closed for at least 12 hours before mixing it up again after it might have cooled up already. You can keep it overnight to have a consistent clear texture before carrying out the next step.
step two, you will still need to add another 300 ml of more cold water to this production again and continue mixing it up to gradually bring out a consistent homogeneous and slime like texture like that of the industrially made tetrapon you usually bought from the marketplace note this tetrapon is not exactly like that of the industrially made tetrapon you usually buy in the market although it will do the same job in your production you must not add up to 300 ml of cold water to it while continuing the step two if you intend to use it for your liquid soap production instead hope you know the essence of making all this production before you go into laundry basket making short and simple is to reduce the cost of your production so that by the time you are into the laundry basket production you'll be able to print more profit by lowering the cost of your production this way your aim of making 40 percent profit will often come out i hope you understand Thank you.